this is reacted content. Most of you know who Markiplier is. He is a very um, loud person, which is why I don't really like his content. However, uh, I don't think this is a trigger warning, but you know, just know what to expect. Definitely won't be family friendly because he swears a lot. So there is that. Uh, however, as far as I have been told, this is a wait there. This is a video that is like interactive. Um, so apparently, when it finishes, depending on what you choose, there you can like go to different ones. I don't know. It's a it's a it's a bit weird. So, um, uh. We will, see, we will see how it is. I'm supposed to really like it, which I believe if it's like, if it's in space, I believe that I will like it. I usually like uh, sci-fi and uh, just space stuff. So we will see. Uh, doing good. You took a nap. That's good. That's good. Naps are always good. Uh, you're playing Gal Val Valheim with your girlfriend and, and done with breakfast. <laughs> I, I like asking everything. I am very... Curious, but also, um, how, how do you say when you like constantly like uh, knowing everything about people even behind their backs? Like you just you just listen, listen like uh, <laughs> what what other people talk between them and so on. How how, how do you say that word? Der, derbna in English. I don't know. Uh, uh, sorry, uh, derbna in uh, Czech. I don't know if uh, you know how we, how how to call it in English. Uh, you liked a date with Marky Price. I, I have I haven't watched it. I have watched his Subnautica playthrough and some other videos of him, but we will see. It's a choose your path video. Yeah, ba basically, yeah, basically that's that's what it is. Um, I think we can go right into it. Very um, ep like not not epic, but like dramatic, dramatic start. So apparently, these kind of videos, the the interactive videos, like where you choose your own path, that has been like very. Um, that has been a very trendy thing back in the past, like yeah, 2012 and 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 and, and around that time. And apparently, more people have done that. I'm sorry, no, I'm staring a lot. Huge fan, huge fan, been following your career for quite a while now. Invisible Tower. This is Shuttle Marmota approaching Docking Bay Four, closing the blast shields. Shuttle Marmota. Yeah, copy you. <laughs> Truth be told, we couldn't afford to show that anyway. But uh, yeah, don't get me wrong. I know exactly where we're at. So Check we out. are supposed to be Markiplier. One, five. Interesting. <laughs> of copy. course, uh, yes. We're here early. I gotta say it's an honor. You know, I think maybe uh, we could hang out or something. Go get a cup of coffee and, you know, beer's cool. Welcome aboard the Invincible 2, Captain. Ah, okay, we are not Markiplier, but we are well, like... It's, it's like a first-person point of view. This is my pride and joy. My baby. Well, your baby, I guess now. But I made her. And a baby will always remember her. Father. Biostaff. Welcome aboard, Captain and Head Engineer. Prepare for sterilization. First stop, the warp core. The heart and soul of the ship. Still not 100% sure how it works, but you don't need to know how something works in order to use it. And when we found it again, it passed every safety test with flying colors. It's not gonna be like last time. Oh, no. Well, this time, the Invincible is finally gonna live up to her. I like how in the, in the background someone case, got like his eyes bleached. A special precaution. If anything goes wrong, 
we can detonate these explosives and separate the warp core. So every video is seven minutes long or something like that, okay? I've yet to meet a problem that can't be solved with explosives. And speaking of explosives, the main reactor. Turns out you pretty much need the power of a star to tear open a wormhole. So a star I built, built like a tank too. <laughs> I mean, this is definitely interesting, more in line with what I like than most of Markiplier content, as wrong as that sounds. Bert. Yep. Yeah, it's Bert. He makes sure that the ship don't go boom. Next up is Cryo. Oh. Hey. The colonists are prepped, stable, and ready for transit. They are very stable, yes. At too, which well, is that's why it's everything... Weird, never hurts. That's why everything is burning, because it's 110. Asshap. Captain, all colonists are prepped and stable. 100,000 souls ready for a new life. Let's get them there safe. Oh, don't worry. Before they know it, they're going to wake up at the side of a brand new planet with a fresh cup of coffee in their hands. Why don't you give them more windows to look through? Well, maybe I will. Maybe then someone might appreciate the aesthetics. Besides, what could go wrong with a crew like this? <laughs> Just a guy limping in the background. Go. Don't worry, Cap. No asteroids getting by me. You can count on that. So handsome and beautiful request Okay. Oh no, Captain, I'm falling. Catch me! Her. This is engines are looking good, Captain. Life is okay. so this is Unless like uh and then we wouldn't know until we passed out. Seems fine. Everything is accounted for. We're ready to see our new home. All that's left now. Hmm. It's for you to say the word. Try not to get them too excited, Captain. I know how your speeches can get people riled up. I have no idea who are these people now. Maybe they are very famous YouTuber, but YouTubers and 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 and, and content creators. But I have I I don't know them. Whoa, I barely know Markiplier, so I like the puppy though. I did like the puppy a lot. It's all right, Captain. I, I'm sure you'll make a great speech once we get there. Mm. Just stealing our alcohol? Why the hell not? Oh, and I forgot to mention, it's not a problem, of course. But just before you go to sleep, be absolutely sure. Do not... Well, I'll open it in 10, 9, 8, Fair. 7, 6, Error. 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 Software update is available. Would you like to restart to a Okay, so um, basically sounds like most software works in uh, money oriented companies, let's say it like that. Good morning, Captain. We are currently error years <laughs> into our journey. Coffee is on route. Come okay, I, I I really like that. Absolutely catastrophic. Wakey wakey protocol. Ouch. Okay, we are in the middle of space. Nice. No, that means we are not crashing into any planet. At least that. Okay, well, Markiplier is dead. That's why there are no videos from him anymore. He died. He died during the filming of this video, by the way. Uh, okay, so do we put out the fire or do we fix life support? Okay, so there are, one of them is, sh is shorter and one of them is longer. Oh, well, the other way around, but doesn't 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 matter it just this is where the decisions come to play there can't be a fire if there is no life support that is true but there is definitely a fire right now um we can do a poll this program by the way he can also do polls uh title put out 
or life. Uh, put out fire. Well, choose. Put out fire. Uh, fix life support. Uh, duration 60 seconds. Pip. There we go. Uh, this program is actually really intuitive to 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 use. <clears throat> so even I can even um, make some kind of like tutorial or some kind of showcase of this program so that everyone in um, everyone in uh, every streamer who is interested in it can use it because I I really like this program. It allows me to do this, for example. By the way, big props to Celestial Kali, who made this uh, background for me. She's amazing. Like She did that completely for free. I really recommend you um, going to check her out. Uh, by the way, I fixed the shoutout command for you, so you can do... You can do uh, SO, exclamation mark SO, and the username, and it can shout out without the clip this time. Uh, okay, so. Slayer, welcome in. Hello. Uh, thank you. Apparently, I am covered by emotes. Okay, never mind. Uh, no, no shout out. So, I Leia. Don't, I don't see why. Oh, damn it. Why did it stop? Okay, weird. Uh, I don't see why we should uh, we should strangle them. <laughs> uh, welcome in Slayer. <laughs> How are you doing? God damn it! Wait, that's not what I wanted to do. There we go. Uh, yeah, it's it's okay. I, I will I will do that at some other point. You are not supposed to do to to, to use that command. It's okay. Uh, how are you, Slayer? Well, welcome in. Uh, yes, Slayer, go to bed. Exactly, exactly. Thank thank you for that, Slayer. I really appreciate you telling Leia to go to bed because she really should. Um, isn't it very late for you as well, uh, Slayer? What what time is it over there? I know for snack it's uh, afternoon. For me, it's uh, 9.25 a.m. in the morning. And for Chusa, it's the same time as me, because he is from Czech Republic. Same as I am, although I don't live there. Um, wait, you're Australian? Slayer? Wow, I had no idea. I thought you were from the U.S. Very interesting. I will have to... Uh, I think I have notification off for your stream, and I definitely... Oh, wow. Okay. I didn't have a follow in your channel. See? Like, okay, Twitch sometimes unfollows or something weird. Um, but yeah. Anyways. Uh, which option one here? Put out the fire. Okay, let's put out the fire. Wait. Yes, yes, I know, I know. <laughs> Hello, there. Hello, Tuta. Welcome in. Yes, we are watching Space with Markiplier. In space, with, in, oh, what, whatever. I need to fix the thing because it doesn't work perfectly. Okay, life support is...
We died. Oxygen is ending, so... Don't worry about Snake, he likes to... Poke. He pokes everyone. So wait, I'm confused now. Yeah, you respawn for some reason, why? I like the effect of Uh, it's okay like I, I asked yes no, don't worry it's okay I, I just like if if I am watching it uh, and I don't know I will ask questions you if if you know the answer you don't need to uh, you don't need to answer because I don't want to know exactly if you know it but uh, if you don't know it then you can of course theorize with me and uh, I got life support back online. I still don't know what the hell is happening, but we seem to have this situation all under control. Yeah. Look at that. Impact detected. Computer, activate the asteroid defense system. Analyzing. No. What do you mean, no? <laughs> Computer, what's wrong with the ADS? Yes, offline. Why? Offline. Computer, what is wrong? Offline. Computer, what's wrong with the ADS? This doesn't make any sense. We got asteroids hitting the ship, but our guns aren't shooting them down. Astero ADS is asteroid defense system, I think. So, you know, we should just be able to point and shoot. The asteroid defense system is. Well, that's new. Something's gone wrong with the computer. The drone shouldn't be able to attack the crew. I programmed that myself. Well, maybe that's the problem. That's why it doesn't work. We gotta fix ADS or we're gonna get blasted a bit. Just like old times, eh, Captain? Pretty much exactly like old times, actually. This is what happened to the first Invincible. But they didn't have you! I know you got a plan to save us cooking up in that big brain of yours. I can see the wheels turning. You faced the odds and beaten them a thousand times before. This is gonna be a cakewalk. I'm practically salivating at the thoughts of how you're gonna save us. Uh, okay, so, uh, don't forget to participate in every poll. Uh, send Mark in. Of course, I say Amrk. I, I, I will show you. Well, I okay, I can I can't show you because send Mark in, fix it from outside. And wake the crew. Um, I mean, you can do the pulse if you. <laughs> okay. Um, mm -mm -mm. Let's do that. <laughs> uh, let's let's uh, keep the conversations to like, uh, I don't know, a decent 
uh, in a decent tone. Uh, don't forget to snag that Tuta hasn't watched it like in the last five years, so I don't think he knows what the answer is. Um, and Tuta tried to like connect with the with the Zen and with the with the chakras in the. Um, in the in the universe so that you can connect with uh, our uh, not angry uh angel that is um yes exactly uh, this is not new this is from wait what the hell it's from 2022 what the hell i, th I thought it was a very new thing like, like a very old thing i thought interactive videos what Okay, I'm so confused right now. So confused. Weird. Okay, never mind. <laughs> so, uh, send Mark in or wake the crew. I don't think the crew is going to be any help. So I get to decide between send Mark in and get the crew. I really don't like Mark in general. But... Um, but I think the crew is also not going to... Um, not going to help. Hmm. Let me think. So, the crew is useless. Mark is useless. So, do we kill the crew or do we wake them up? If we wake up the crew, Mark won't die. So, um... I'm not talking a chat, don't worry. Like, you can tell me what to do, but I will not listen. The only way for you to... Tell me what to do is by the polls. So please be sure to vote in them. Uh, Mark is useless. The crew is useful. I don't think that's true. Both are useless. I will pick the crew basically because uh, yeah, I, I know, but the third option wasn't um, wasn't voted at all. I'm picking between these two because these two each one had a, had a, had the vote. So that's why. Yes, connect to the chakra, Tuta, please. Otherwise, like if if you if you put too much caps, the bot will time you out. I will wake up the crew just because uh, it means that Markiplier will, will live, so we will have two useless entities and not only one because the crew will be still well. Actually, not only zero because the crew will be still asleep. And the well, I'm not scamming you. If you forgot to to vote, that's not my issue. I'm sorry. Like you need to be, you need to pay attention to chat. Like. I'm not gaslighting you. It just, I just can't take into account people uh, that don't see it. Like, okay, but you see, you see it in chat. Like, come on now, you see the poll in chat. So just okay, pay attention to chat. Fair, fair. Okay, you have been warned. Wake up the crew because at least this way Mark doesn't die. Oh, yeah. Your your butt is a scam. Yes, I can. You will get an exact refund of zero points. Well, I've been through hundreds of refund, refund sent. Did you receive my refund for zero? I'll do my best if you think I'm the right person for the job. Well, not my okay. choice. But Good the captain is the captain. So, Mrs. Whitaker, we need you to get in oh, the no, asteroid. No, I'm not married anymore, young man. Care for a cookie? Sure. Would love one. Appreciate it. Miss Whitaker, we need you to get in the asteroid defense system and fix it. Well, well, when the captain tells you to do something, you best well get it done, I always say. And there's no problem a plate of cookies can't solve. Hello, Mary. Care for a I don't think a grandma turned into something. The other guy turned into grandma. So basically, let, let, let's do one thing. Uh, Tuta only answer if you uh, don't remember what happened, okay? If you are thinking like this happened, that happened, then don't answer. Let's do it like that. What did we do? Asteroid defense system online. Oh. Oh. 
<laughs> How did we get here? Warning, coolant leak in cryo. Oh, can we move? Uh, okay. Well, Captain, I guess we gotta fix the problem. So, are they very cold? Oh yeah, they are very cold. Okay. So, um, wait, no, I pressed, I pressed, uh, the wrong thing. So, uh, can you do the poll layer or? Okay, I think that was done. Yay. Thank you, Leia, so much. You're so amazing as always. Uh, Please don't write in caps, as that those messages will be removed. Uh, the poll is uh, on right now, so don't forget to vote before you complain that you forgot to vote. <laughs> See, Markiplier wakes up the toxic in us <laughs> i didn't know uh i didn't know that this was new for some reason i thought that um it's one to one don't forget to vote to decide which one of the two options uh wake the crew of things from the south i guess it's up to me again Fix from the outside. Like, why would we fix it from the outside? I don't think there is a reason to fix anything from the outside. For some reason. Okay. So. You may have forgotten to vote. Yes. Oh, well. See, I cannot re. Well, you know, I will send you your refund now of zero points, player. There you go. The refund was sent. Uh, also, sorry if you hear some random sounds outside there, like cutting the the grass once again. So let's wake the crew because once again, I don't think going outside will help. Like there is nothing to uh, there is nothing to fix from the outside. I don't think. That's a pretty good idea. CC knows the system, so she should be able to fix it. But I swear, if she starts questioning my designs again... What stupid designs call a problem again, Captain? Oh, why, no, Dr. Kelvina. They did. But it seems like there's a leak in your cooling system, though. Well, it's probably because you put a fusion reactor next to my cryo bay. Oh, I put a fusion reactor next to your cryo bay because the magnetic field protects your colony. Oh, no. Why don't you just put more glass windows on a spaceship, you idiot? Oh, my, my, look at you. Nothing but skin and bones. Would you like a cookie, dearie? Oh, wait, there's a problem in cryo. Uh, do you have any experience? In oh, no! So... Yeah, the leak. The Damn it, I can't reach the cookie. Yeah, we should. Uh... We need to do something. Uh, uh, Mrs. Whitaker, it's very cold in there. <laughs> You're gonna need some kind of protection. There's a coolant leak. You're Exactly. That, that's that's grandma's. Basically, they they just. It's okay. I'm not told. Also, she dies every time. Apparently. What? Warning: colonist core temperature rising beyond unsafe levels. What? Why does every single? Oh well. Again, respawn again. Okay, see. Time to wake up, Captain. Yeah, I mean the animations. The animations are really good, but well, I don't know if if you are 
One of the top five earning. Captain? Uh, what did you do? And why are we in cryo? All in good time, sir. What? I said warning. Reactor overload imminent. Okay, I guess. We're not. Whatever. I do know that the reactor going kablooey is real bad, so Captain, we gotta do something. We gotta do it now. Come on, let's move. Captain, you know how when you're in a dream and you're trying to run, you really? can't get anywhere, and you feel like you're not making any progress? I kind of feel like that right about now. And also, I feel like whatever's behind this door is gonna kill us. So, maybe don't open it. I'll defer to you. You usually have the plans, right? You always do. Uh, can you just push it? No, why didn't he push it? Uh, okay, there you have the answers. Leia, thank you so much. You're so quick. Don't forget to vote, everyone. Poll is up. How is it going? Mm -mm -mm. Okay, two votes for fix from the outside. I don't think anyone else will vote, but I will still wait just in case for the for the for any other possible votes. I mean, the crew has let us down already twice. It's just that the time shift has uh, has occurred. Like, I mean. The crew turns always into a grandma, and the grandma always screws it up. But then uh, we respawn, so I don't think that's... Um... Captain, wait! I... You're not Weird. going to the airlock, are you? Okay, great. Sorry, Captain. For some reason, and I know it's crazy, I had this bizarre feeling like you were going to throw yourself out of the ship's airlock. <laughs> Like I could see it in my mind's eye. Captain, no! Captain, I knew it! I knew you were going to throw yourself out of the airlock! How did I know that? Captain, okay. What you... What you... Wait, no, I... I... Okay, yeah. I mean, I kind of expected this to happen. Because... Software update complete. Good morning, Captain. Coffee is en route. Current ship status is nominal. I think the response happened because Markiplier wants us to keep watching. If we died and it was game over, people would just oh, stop morning, and not watch Thanks, again. Sweet. Good? Oh, man. Are we early? I didn't expect... No, like, of course it's not breaking because he did not hit I'm the... I'm flattered, but could you let go of my hand? The glass broke every time because Markiplier hit the glass like that. There is no fire. No, there is no fire. Captain, are you feeling okay? Oh, morning, Captain. Did you sleep well? Morning, Captain. Not Creepy a face. single asteroid tried to hit us this whole journey. Some pretty good luck. You're a boring pansy. But don't worry, Cap. I'll find something to shoot. Check the ADS. Why? Why aren't you checking the ADS? Captain, all colonists are healthy and accounted for. I might even owe Mark an apology. Maybe. That face was really weird from her. I don't think everything is okay. Fishermen know that the sea is dangerous and the storm terrible, but they've never found these dangers sufficient reason to remain ashore. No, we cannot go there. Okay, we can go there. Captain? You seem a little stressed. I know that cryo sleep can affect everyone differently, but coffee always helps. Relax. You did it! You got us here safely. Take a moment to enjoy it. This... this smug is... what? It's actually a bomb, okay. I mean... Maybe. What? 
Computer, what's wrong with the warp core? Warp core cannot be reached. I know you can't reach it, but what's wrong with it? I don't know what's happening, Captain, but it can't be good. Well, that's uh, new. Oh, yeah, good idea. Captain, I don't know what that is, but I know bad news when I see it. And that is bad news. We gotta get back to the bridge right now. Whoa. I wonder if this is what happened to the first Invincible. But they didn't have plans. Oh, morning, Captain. Well, why? Why? Do we really work like this? Captain, Mark got our asses stuck in a wormhole. No, I did. No, maybe I did. My God. Mark got us stuck in a goddamn wormhole. All stress is redlining across all decks. How did Mark even cause this much damage? I don't think I do, Leia, no. But maybe I do. Event Horizon Protocol. I don't really like Event Horizon, but... Protocol activation successful. Wakes up old trauma from a movie called Event Horizon. What? You knew it. You knew something was wrong. And boy, were you glad to prove it. With the Event Horizon Protocol initiated, the ship was finally free from the devastating effects of the wormhole. Although left to drift among the stars, luckily, you just so happened to end up in a system with a beautiful planet suitable for habitation. Humanity's first colony among the stars would be a smashing success. The colonists celebrated this momentous occasion and eagerly awaited setting foot on this wonderful new planet. But you kept the colonists aboard the ship for a while. You needed time to check the planet for it, after all. When they asked you what it was, you simply responded that it was whatever they wanted to happen as soon as you let your guard down. Your crew didn't feel the need to question you further, and were more than happy to wait a few years aboard the ship while you finished scouring every corner of the planet for it. But once your checks were complete, the colony positively thrived. After you built an extensive network of defense systems and surveillance systems, of course, you knew that it was still out there just waiting for the right moment to strike. And with those systems in place, your people enjoyed the bounties of a practically idyllic planet. They also enjoyed the bounty of bi-daily random security screenings. Wouldn't want it to show up in the middle of a supervised safety meal, now would we? But your people were happy when you allowed them to be. After all, happiness could lead to complacency, which could be disastrous when it eventually struck. But that was never going to happen, not under your watchful eye. The colony would be safe from them for many, many This is very weird, like I have no idea what they are talking about even. Sure of it. Okay, so that's like Dune? A little bit? Go towards the light. I don't think. I mean, maybe, maybe we we did go insane, but. So we wake up again, right? Yeah, we wake up again, of course. Of course we do. Removing head engineering. Captain. Does this feel like you? Familiar to you? Captain, where are you going? Fire on the bridge. Fire extinguished. Life support systems failing. Oxygen levels rising. 
Asteroid defense system is offline. Why is it offline? Asteroid defense system online. Asteroid. Warning. Could be in trouble. Okay, so where are we going apparently? <laughs> Mm. Oh, okay. So choice, I guess. What, what, what if we don't go? Add, add a third option, Leia, and uh, add like do nothing or just wait. <clears throat> because, wait. Uh, wait. Ca ca can you can you cancel it and do it again? Add a third option where it's like do nothing or 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 just wait something like that. <clears throat> yeah, please. Because, I mean, we have the option to just stay watching, even whatever that means. <clears throat> oh wait, god damn it! <laughs> I forgot I had that uh, here. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, don't worry, just make a new poll then. Uh, yeah, I cannot cancel either. Oops. Yep. Yeah, don't worry. So, uh... One of the reasons I think we keep respawning all the time is because, as I explained, if we didn't respawn, if we just died, then, um, yeah, it would be over and Markiplier would not get the extra views from keeping watching. So, yeah. Okay, so, jump in, cannonball ball or neither. You can decide. Don't forget to vote each one of you, including Leia, including Tuta. Uh... Okay, so cannonball then it is. Wait, no, how do I... I cannot click it. Wait. What the hell are you so I cannot really click it. Does that mean that we have to go with with uh with neither? What, are you doing? what the hell is that? What the hell is happening? No more! No more. It ends here. I'm not gonna let you do it. I'm not gonna let you do it. You're gonna Tell me what you did, you're gonna tell me, and then you are going to undo all of the damage that you have done. Huh. Okay, look, um, <clears throat> lady, first of all, welcome to our ship, and I know it looks bad, but usually it's a lot better. Not you! You! <coughs> everything that you destroyed, everyone that you have killed, you are going to undo everything right here, right now! Warning, reactor overload. <laughs> okay, uh, good morning again. Oh wait, no, we are in the wormhole now. Okay, so we entered a door or something. Paradox detected. Paradox entertainment. Requesting suitable host. Paradox detected. Requesting suitable scanning. Suitable host located. There is no way to fix it, it's just a Twitch API that... 
if the Twitch API counts a follow as unfollowing and following again, there is nothing I can do uh, with that. Like, I cannot change the Twitch API. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Emergency Wiki Wiki protocol override acknowledged. Opening trial bar. Am I? Are you? Did I? Did you? Did we? <laughs> We're immortal! Or something like that. I distinctly remember falling through that door and then ending up in the center of a star. And then slowly feeling the flesh melt from my bones. But slowly. I'm and you're alive. That wouldn't happen and slowly. I, and you remember, right? This is incredible. Like you would be Computer, dead in literal milliseconds because not only the Protocol temperature but also the pressure course. from the star would like crush you into into like system rebooted. Like you you would be your whole body would be like this. Okay. Uh, computer, can you shut down the warp core? Negative. Warp core cannot be reached. Okay. So the wormhole's still a problem, and my emergency repair protocol can't shut it down from here. We need to get in the warp core somehow. But that shouldn't be a problem for two immortal gods like us. The way I see it, all we need to do is keep jumping in, and eventually we'll find the right door, we'll get to the warp core, shut it down, save the colonists, and then you and me can enjoy our newfound powers until they slowly drive us mad and turn us away from everything we know and love. <laughs> so what do you say? Come on, let's jump in again. What's the worst that could happen? We could die again, I guess. That wasn't... That wasn't so bad. That wasn't so bad. Hmm. Let's do a poll, this time for real. Emergency meeting or jump in again. I mean, I don't know. Jump in again would mean we would be constantly in a loop. Since I can drink whenever I want, I actually should drink more. Like, what if I have no viewers for a stream and no one tells me to drink? Does that mean that I just dehydrate and die? No. I guess I, I, I just have to drink. Even if you don't tell me like this, look. I just drank. <laughs> don't forget to vote. You didn't vote. You didn't vote in the poll. Snack. Snack, you didn't vote in the poll. Okay, thank you. Like, see? Like, if, if I don't remind you, you would just forget again. And that sounds like a you problem. Since uh, it's one to one, no one won, so I will be calling an emergency meeting because I feel jumping in again would just. Okay, you know what? It's only 40 seconds. It's only 40 seconds. So let, let, let's do that. Hell yeah! We'll be at that warp core before you know. I'm sure I'm that, uh... So, this time, I'll dash right, you dash! Yeah, basically, it will just keep repeating itself over and over. Ah, okay. I'm not quite what I expected. But now we know what not to do. So, what do you say? Let's jump in again. Exactly, that was my 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 point, that it would just repeat itself yeah, over and over. They deserve to know what's happening. And they might have some ideas how to solve this. Probably not good ones, though. <laughs> so, I'm a ...and thorough explanation of the situation. The mark of a great leader, always being open and honest with the crew, never holding anything back. Sweetest thing... <laughs> Far worse than weeds. What? Uh, 
The bottom line is, we need to get to the warp core and shut it down. It's having effects that I never could have predicted. The captain and I, we've tried some things, but we need fresh ideas. Yeah. Have you tried blowing it up? Obviously they've tried blowing it up. Look who you're working with! I know we haven't! That is a disclaimer for a reason, no, by the not. way. You know nothing about wormholes. You could actually cause a false vacuum collapse. Well, no, we wouldn't, and also that's impossible. I what think. if we back the ship up into the wormhole? What if we pop her in reverse and just undo all the wormhole stuff? Okay, Mark, I owe you an apology because obviously you're not the stupidest <laughs> person on this ship. Thank you. Hey, Captain. You never do my stuff. Clearly, we need to send out a distress signal because someone sabotaged this ship. You know, now that she mentions it, some of the damage on the ship did seem intentional. I think someone needs to go over every inch of this ship and do some rap. Oh, no, 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 no one sabotages a ship because the only two people that can change anything on the ship are me and the captain. And the only person that I trust more than myself is the captain. And two, how could anybody find us if we don't know where we are? That's my point exactly. We don't know where we are, we don't know how we got here, and we have the lives of the colonists at stake. Or... Hear me out. No, no, it's not up to you. It's not up to you. And I'm sorry, it's not up to you. It's up to the captain. They haven't let us down yet. Well, I have let myself down every single day of my life, but okay, sure. Uh, choice, decisions, Paul. What's the plan? Distress signal or... How are we getting out of this? Pop or in the reverse. What do you say? Which one would you choose? Um, I will lurk someone else now. I was lurking threat. Let me lurk. Um, mm -mm. I will. I will lurk you, peek instead now. So, which one are you choosing? You're choosing reverse. Okay. Well then, then we reverse. Captain? No, you can't possibly think about that. Hey, you heard the captain, and they know what's best. I know, and this is such a horrible idea, it's gonna kill all oh, of us. relax, the captain knows what they're doing, don't you, Captain? I'm sorry, I feel like I'm crazy. We're all gonna die. Oh my god, for once in your life, just step back and put your faith in proper leadership. <laughs> you got this, Captain? What? The current ship status broken, just like my marriage. Here sure. I am again, back for another ride on the merry-go-round of life. Do I look super crisp? I, I do seem super crisp. Am I some kind of god? Or was this just I don't know if it's just the screen or something. You on with beautiful promises, only to stab you in the back and leave you for dead. Whatever it was, at least the company's nice. Yeah. Seems like that didn't work. Yeah, this is this sounds Captain. like a uh, detective oh, well. old yeah, movie. All. all problems solved. Well, not all problems. Not the problem of my broken heart. Oh no. Some problems can't be solved with a swing of the fist, no matter how strong you are. When the love of your life tears you to also pieces, like his his uh well, wound that just won't heal. The kind of wounds that leads you down. Oh my god, I, I... I forgot about uh, how how the to right through me with how to call this piece eyes, of clothing. The kind of look that could kill, and the kind of looks that could kill to match. Maybe someday I'll work up the courage to ask that. Chris, that not quip. What? What yeah, even right. is that word? Maybe someday I'll destroy the universe. So, Captain, got any other ideas to get us out of this mess? Or, uh, you're just happy to see me. What? Okay. Yeah, but you send the typo as well. So, distress signal 
or fire all weapons. Six minutes video. Okay, this is much longer than I expected, actually. So I will want a refund from the person who suggested it. You know who you are. <laughs> I thought it would be shorter. I thought this interactive movie thing would be much shorter. But of course, if we have a minute between each poll, then yeah, I understand. Don't forget to vote. Only one person voted. Only one. Okay. Okay. Let's do that then. I was hoping you'd say that, Captain. I've been itching to get some payback on this wormhole for all the hell it's put us through. But why couldn't I shake the terrible feeling clutching my heart? Pulling the trigger felt right. I wanted to do it, but at the same time, in the back the of my mind, the same button does everything. Okay. I suspected that this would come back to haunt us in the worst way. Looks like that's that. You did it, Captain. I always believed in you. You know what, Leia? I think you can do 30 seconds from now on. 30 seconds is enough. Uh -huh. If someone isn't uh -huh. paying attention, then uh -huh. Uh -huh. it's okay. It's for you. It's me, the wormhole. I bet you thought I was dead, didn't you? Oh, I gotta admit, it was a pretty good shot. Okay, this is getting very ridiculous. Wrong number. Hmm. They took more than a year to film this. It's got multi. Yeah, I, I, I know it's like uh, uh, my girl made like a whole scheme or like uh, how do you even call that? With a sucking like a tree with a all the possible options and, and paths and stuff. Invincible two finds themselves back in their cryopod. Just to see all the options. The looks around, slightly confused for unknown reasons. Eventually, they get on with it and pull the emergency release to free them from the confines of their cryogenic prison. Stepping you can you can use seconds. I think you can use thirty seconds. If they are perhaps stuck in some sort of purgatory doomed to endlessly repeat the mistakes of the past. The captain's intrepid engineer also wonders the same as they emerge from their pod. Captain, do you hear something? The captain laughs a boisterous laugh at what is, obviously, another one of Mark's hilarious rooms. Mark must still be delirious from the after effects of cryogenic slumber. Right. Now, to be honest, we've all seen this part before, and I don't want the viewers at home to get bored. So why don't we skip ahead a few pages and get to our good friend? Hello there. What? Wait, what viewers? What did you say? What viewers? What? What? Ow! You! Wug, being the stoic, battle-hardened brute that he is, is unfazed by this new turn of events and proceeds to extract the English language out of Mark's soft, supple skull. What? Wug pilots the ship to the space fast food restaurant. The captain grabs the food. There you go! I did it! Oh, sorry. That's supposed to be a Wug-only fast food restaurant. The ship arrives at the Universal Stability Agency. We here! Arrival! We here! Oh, uh, Wug removes the helmet from Mark's soft, soft skull. Oh, Owie! And so our intrepid adventurers have arrived at the Universal Stability Agency. But is it too late for them to stop the rampaging wormhole that they have unleashed upon the cosmos? The captain thinks back to all the, the faces of changes the in pace and care. in narrating. Will they be able to save them, or will they be really are really confusing because you just I mean at least for me I just lose all kind of attention or 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 grip of what's happening, and like my brain just turns off. one way to find out. The bandit enters. The bandit leaves. Bonk. You. What have you done? Not so fast. Now we get to the interrogation. You are destroying everything. The bandit knocks out Lady. Oh, so this lady what? is. <clears throat> I said it's uh, Lady. That's not my name, and no, I'm not gonna do that. <sighs> it's 
so hard not working with professionals. A vent cover falls on Lady's head. I said that's not my fault. What the hell? And back to the ship. There we are, back on track, and not a moment too soon. With the device so who are these people? And our intrepid captain now has the tools necessary to make their way to the warp core without further delay. But will the twisting holes of the invincible I'm sorry. What did you say they have? The uh, uh the ah, uh, the portable temporal displacement device. You know, the MacGuffin that allows our captain to navigate the chaos that is this ship. I didn't give them anything like that. Oh, my God. Okay. The captain looks down and sees the device. It glows. The captain can get okay. to the warp Okay, I, I like this. I like a narrator it. just there. changing stuff that's happened. All you need happens. to do now is use the device and you'll be well on your way to part two of this whole ordeal. So the real business can begin. I'm sorry. Part two? What does that mean? You're not supposed to be here. <gasps> I'm so confused. Captain, Captain, I don't know what the hell's going on, but if there's another option that gets us out of here that doesn't involve listening to a crazy voice in our head, we might want to take that one. There is no other option written here. The next page literally says the captain uses the device and in a flash of blinding light is transported to another universe. There's no other way. Okay. You must move forward. I can't do well, anything for you. Uh, so yeah, there is plan K and use the device. We have no idea what the plan K is. How are you so quick? <laughs> Um, mm, mm, mm. use the device or plan K. Okay, so it's tied. It's tied, so I don't know which one option to choose. Um, let's think. So using the device means that we will listen to the narrator. Is that good or bad? We don't know. <laughs> the plan K means that we will not be listening to the narrator. In theory. Although maybe we will, I don't know. Like we don't know what plan K is. So let's actually I think try plan K unless someone votes in the last moment. Okay, both options won. So let's try plan K because we just don't know what it is. What are you doing? What's up, Captain? You got a plan? No, no, no. That is not part of the story. You can't do that. This is expressly illogical, and I won't have it. Where's my pen? Damn, my pen! Hold on! Uh, what is that? Is that good? That's not good. Captain, what are you doing? Don't do what I think. No, no, the no, 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 uh, no, The captain changes their mind. What? Are you waiting for me? All right, fine. The ship blows up, I guess. Unbelievable. You deserve what's coming to you. Okay, and they... They return, yeah, and once again. Having fun, Captain. Darkness. You know, they say every choice spawns a new universe. Oh wow, the and the if lady. That's the case. What kind of universes do you think your choices have been making? <laughs> Not great ones, given its market marketing it choices. Hard to save your crew, have you, Captain? What's well, one choice among the infinite? You might ask. One mistake is not all. And it's true, not all choices matter. But all lives do matter. Some choices. Captain, some choices are everything. Including animal so, lives. I'm going to make this easy for you. I'm only going to give you one choice. Then there is no, Then this, it is not a choice. This portal will take you right where you need to be. But where do we need to be? All you have to do is step inside. Okay, and where is where we need to be? Do you decide Don't you it? you want to save your people? You're the only one who can. Uh... Think long and hard about this. Well, now I'm not doing it. 
Do you understand the ramifications of your decision? Well, I can see the wheels turning, but is the hamster dead? <laughs> okay, so... No means no. Nice. Nice, Leia. Uh, I don't know. Like, I kind of dislike this option because it's 11 minutes long. But I think it's inevitable. Like, even if we do the the now I'm not doing it option that we will still have to do step in the wormhole. I don't know. I don't know. I think that I know how they did that. Yeah, it's unlisted. So all the videos, except the first one, are unlisted, so people cannot just jump into them. Uh, instead, they have to, like, go through the video. It's, it's, it's an interesting... Um, it's an interesting way of, of... Wait, wait, what? Okay, oops, I, I, I picked the wrong one. <laughs> Uh, okay, there we go. She didn't ask for consent before entering. That is very true. We showed her the finger. Looking for this? Oh, Captain, I can't say I'm surprised. You always were stubborn. But that's your choice. You always did have a choice. Mark Fischbach. Oh, Such that's the real name of Markiplier, I guess. Choices you're making. That's uh. What have you done? Do you even know who you are? Do you feel like you've been here before? That's a German uh, pros. Or is this just history? Proceedings or or. Over and over and huh. over. Very interesting. <laughs> Is that old Mark? I think that's old Mark. Part German and part Korean. Actually, now that you mentioned that, I see his Korean uh, traits. I never noticed, like, I, I noticed his face, but I never thought of it. And now that you say it, like, I clearly see the Korean um, traits in his face. Okay, so it's... Is it going to do this for the rest of the video? Okay. Rebooting universe, please stand by. Estimated time remaining 27 days. 28 days. 0.01, yay! Okay. I think that's... Uh... I think that's pretty fun. Okay, I enjoy that. I have to say, I I did enjoy it. Uh, it is very original. I have to say, like I, I mean, even if the concept is very easy, just you know, have a choice, and one video is one choice, and the other video is another choice. Like, it took a lot of planning. Uh, and uh, thinking about it, and I have to praise Markiplier for that. There is also very little of his childish humor, so I actually enjoyed the series, even though there were some parts that were very childish and... Um, <laughs> and, uh, yeah, with uh, hit-and-miss humor, let's call it like that. But at least there wasn't, like, any discrimination or sexism, which wouldn't have surprised me, but I am... Uh, I'm glad there wasn't. Uh, I didn't like 
not one as much as a heist or a date i have i have i have no idea like i only watched him for the gaming videos so yeah i'm not really into original content but this one was recommended to me and i have to say that i'm thankful for for trying it 